everyone, welcome back to Wixfix. Today we're diving into the world of Wix animations. Adding animations to your website can bring your design to life, making it more engaging for visitors. So let's get started. First, let's open the Wix editor. If you're new to Wix, let's head over to your dashboard and select edit site on any of your projects. Uh, so next, let's um, move over to what we're trying to create today, right? So today we're going to be creating this uh, scroll stack animation where on scroll, the section seems like it's stacking on top of each other. Uh, and I'll show you the best way to achieve uh, achieve this animation. So the way you have to do this is select make, uh, you just select one section and divide this into four rows. Each of these rows, I've set it in a way where it covers the entire height of the screen, which is 100 to height. So if you see this, and if I click on the section and I go to its row properties, as you can see, I've set each of these cells to 100 view height. Essentially, each cell will be covering my the entire height of my screen. Now, the way we achieve this animation is by using uh, something called a, something known as sticky, where we are able to uh, attach certain sections, elements, or anything to the page or the section, right? So as you can see, if I click on the cell, its position type is set to sticky, stick to top with an offset of 0%. Offset, what offset would do is it will uh, add a certain uh, amount of distance from the top of the page uh, such that it creates a bit of offset. So, so for certain elements, it might make sense. But here we're going to keep it at zero. So because we want to create, uh, we want it such that the cell covers the entire page uh, that we're scrolling through, right? So make sure all of these are set to 100 uh, view height and make sure all of these are position type set to sticky, stick to top with an offset of 0%. Now let's go to the layers. One other thing that you have to make sure is each of these elements, each of these cells have to be uh, layered on top of each other. That is because uh, if if this uh, is layered below, then while scrolling, this section, this section is this cell is always going to remain on top, therefore ruining the animation effect completely. So let's go to layers. Make sure each of these cells are on top of each other. That way we know that it won't overlap on top of each other, right? So make, you can use a layers panel to make sure this is maintained. Uh, now let's go ahead with the, uh, let's quickly preview this just to see how this looks. As you can see, as you scroll, the section is stacking on top of each other. Now, if it was layered wrong, then this animation wouldn't look like this. Uh, so yeah, this is a very simple way to create this uh, animation. Obviously, uh, definitely would uh, love for everyone to put, uh, set it up in a way that they can personalize their own and use this technique to create wonderful animations. It's all about your personal preference. The goal is to make the animation natural uh, and cohesive with your site's design. Uh, Wix also allows you to uh, also allows you to animate specific elements with the animation. So make sure to use all of these animations and effects where I will be showing you in future videos in more detail how you can fully utilize the uh, aspects that Wix offers. Okay, and that's it uh, for this video. Uh, adding animations to your Wix site is a great way to make it stand out. Have fun with it and remember, sometimes a little animation can go a long way. If you found this tutorial helpful, make sure to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe for more tips on Wix and web design, and let me know in the comments what you'd like to see next.